Leaked Pentagon documents obtained by the Washington Post are revealing potentially concerning cracks in Canada's military and its relationship with NATO. Within the secret trove, private revelations by the Prime Minister over military spending. Here's CTV's Judy Trent. Military secrets allegedly leaked by a low-ranking U.S. airman on social media have ensnared Canada's leader. The Washington Post reports that classified documents reveal that Prime Minister Justin Trudeau has privately told NATO officials Canada will never meet the military alliance's pledge of spending 2% of its GDP on defence. Trudeau deflected, but didn't deny. I continue to say and will always say that Canada is a reliable partner to NATO, a reliable partner around the world. Canada only spends 1.29% of its GDP on the military, according to NATO. It has for decades under successive governments failed to reach its target. Analysts are only surprised the Prime Minister said the quiet part out loud. Anybody like me that actually looks at our, our budget math and what we're planning to spend would see that we have no intention of meeting our 2% target. So I guess the novelty there is that he's actually saying that explicitly to some of our allies. The documents revealed Germany worries that Canada won't be able to continue assisting in Ukraine. That Turkey is disappointed Canada didn't transport humanitarian aid after February's deadly earthquake. And Haiti is allegedly frustrated Ottawa isn't stepping up to lead a mission. The opposition wants the government to do more. Canada's always been uh, one that uh, has depended uh, too heavily upon uh, other nations to provide that collective security. Uh, we definitely have benefited from it. One former defence official says failure to increase spending could lead to devastating results. And that price is going to be pay paid by the young men and women that we put in uniform on that war eventually arrives because the better prepared they are, the lower the butcher's bill is going to be when the conflagration erupts. Under Trudeau, military spending has increased and the government plans to spend an additional $8 billion over the next five years. But Omar, that's nowhere close to NATO targets. All right, Judy, thank you. Canada and